Hello, I got Amory's Tomb here. Kind of a intense label. Probably hard to see it on camera. And it says Amory's Tomb down here. Most of their beers brewed or sold from the tap room. <clears throat> but so this is like one of my favorite Saison brewers in all of New England. They do all sorts of Saisons, um, a lot of really good clean ones. They're in this little town called Maynard just past um, Concord. <clears throat> so it's like drive past uh, Walden Pond a little bit further from Boston. So this is 6.4% alcohol. They call it a Saison Moderne, but it's a very hoppy, new wave hop Saison. It's got barley, rye, and then hopped with layers of crystal, amarillo, and citra. I've had a couple of their other sort of Saison Modernes um, with lot with heavy new wave hopping, but not this one. And this one's stronger. I've had ones that were more like five and a half. This is the canning from September 21st. So that's like less than, less than three months in the can. Um, but the best by date, you know, is a year after canning. It might be, I'm not sure, but this might be naturally carved in the can. It doesn't say can conditioned. Maybe not, <clears throat> but it's it's very highly carbonated. And the cool thing is, I bought a total wine. First time I've ever seen their beer there. But since their tap room is like under construction and still closed for the winter time, looks like they're probably gonna ship beers around. So look out for them. You see cans of this sort of design. Um, they make all sorts of styles. They're all really good. And that is super pale, very clear and sitting in the can for a while. I bet there's a, some sediment, but with, yeah, with that carbonation, I should have rinsed this glass first. It could, it could be natural carb. Like look at all them bubbles in there, but not necessarily. And obviously really big head, but super how, it's cool how super clear that is. So did I call it its name? It's Astral Traveler by Amory's Tomb. 100% New England grown barley. Now this force, what is it called? Northeast Grains Company has this little label. It says this has four square feet of grains in this can itself. Yeah, um, which is pretty, pretty cool, but also puts it into perspective how much raw resource, like four square feet. It's not nothing just to make 16 ounces of beer and very li lively carb. The head's not popping so fast. That head's probably gonna stick around for a while. <sighs> yep. <clears throat> that is a really nice sort of pear and pepper Saison notes. And the hops are not banging you overhead. Well, there's <clears throat> the citrus kind of moving into like almost a sort of a sweet bubblegum type ester, which I usually don't get bubblegum in in saisons that much. <sighs> yeah, maybe it's moving it towards a, like a Belgian IPA territory, which Belgian IPA people, brews don't really make them much anymore. But it's supposed to be super dry. <sighs> but yeah, this the smell is. And just candy, pear, not apple. Um, yeah, that, that, that's that's really what I get. Big league chew, cotton candy bubble gum, like bubble yum that's cotton candy flavored. Fluffy and soft on the tongue, but it is dry. Um, but all those sort of sweet flavors make it taste kind of sweet, even though it's not, there's not lots of syrupy, sticky malt going on. <clears throat> really fantastic head. That's going to stick around forever. It's got, you can't really see, that's the problem with these videos, is I can't angle the camera down so you can see the rocky, bubbly, foaminess that's happening. Yeah, now I'm getting more of the hops. 
<clears throat> some orange and some sort of clean resin. Mm -hmm. It's pretty peppery, but nothing coarse in this beer. <clears throat> I'm wondering if there's some sediment going on. Yeah, now that's not crystal clear. I wonder if the sediment could have a little bit more of the hop flavor crystals. Yeah, it's smelling a little bit hoppier to, to me now. Yeah, just more sweet orange. Super light and fluffy, but it's got body to it. <clears throat> it's not for many brewers are making stuff like this. Like maybe I could get Tank 7. I feel like the last time I got Tank 7, wasn't a huge fan of it. That's um, Boulevard's so kind of their flagship beer almost. It's one of the few breweries that ships, I think it's their, their Saison across the country. It's like a, it's a, I think it's an Amarillo hopped Saison. It's stronger though. But this is not like a lot of Saisons that are force carbed um, and just super dry and just kind of lifeless. It's, you can, you can make a beer that's, you know, really dry, but it has body. So this has body and the carb keeps it very lively. It's really what Saison should be. Saison shouldn't just be something that looks like an IPA and is hopped like an IPA, but then doesn't have lively carbonation, doesn't have just the, the, the really Belgian aspects. And you can see we've got some cool lacing and stuff happening. Yep, definitely. I'm pretty sure this is can carved. I don't know. I don't know how you could do this. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't seen a, a beer this this highly carved in a can that's not th through natural carbonation in the can where they add live yeast and a little bit of sugar and it ferments in there. But it leads to a lot of burps. All right, I'll just see if I can get a little more at the bottom in there. This is very, very good. Oh yeah, really nice looking head. Mm. And really nice feel. No booziness. Not sharp and bitter, though it's so dry. No medicinal off flavors. And even, even the, the head is a little weird. Yeah, Saison's. Especially Brett beers, this is not Brett, this is clean. But a lot of times the Saison's, the head is the dry, chalky, kind of bitter pill type part. But the beer itself, I got nothing. No no chalky, bitter pill stuff. Fantastic, yeah, this is a five. Sorry, four and a half. I mean, could you improve on it? Maybe a little bit. I could ask for a little bit more hop character, but it also is not uber fresh um but it can definitely you can keep aging it and it'll just get a little bit more of that age stays on quality and lose some of the hop character which i like that sort of thing too but yes four and a half plus for me bye